Hey, what's up, you guys? So today I wanted to do a different type of video. I'm going to be more transparent in this video and future videos to come, especially with the Q&A that I'm working on. If you guys haven't already submitted your questions in the Q&A, make sure to check my community post. It's the most recent post and add your questions in the comments below. All right. So um, seeing this, I know everybody has seen this video go viral. But Michael B. Jordan ran to somebody from high school. And it got me thinking <laughs> that like this this is for any of you guys that's in high school right now and you're feeling depressed or you're feeling social anxiety and all of that stuff. Even if you're not in high school, I hope this video helps because it's so funny how that video pops up. And then like I was planning on making a video about this a while ago, but if you guys are in that same boat, trust me, I have been there. If you guys saw the, <laughs> you guys had to have seen the thumbnail. That's real. Like, I'll put the picture up again, right there. All right. That's the only picture in my yearbook of me, other than my graduation photo. And there's a reason for that. You know, I've been labeled as the corny kid, the quiet kid. I've had, I, uh, throughout all my years of high school, I believe I, I have a total of five friends out of that and it, it's it's been crazy I, I know a lot of you guys are in high school that's why i asked in the community tab use me as an example on the fact that once you like go through all of that like it doesn't define who you are use me as an example i'm telling you right now i have like i've been i've been to the point of in high school where teachers didn't trust me students always wanted to test me um i've been absent a lot i mean it, with all of that going on it, it got to the point where i was like you know what I, it's better if i don't even i don't even go and i've i've missed a total of 60 days per year and it, it got to the point where attendance counselors were coming to my house while I'm hiding in my house from my dad who from time to time decided to stay home from work not knowing at all that I'm there um, I've had times where I've had to sneak out of my house from the second floor to sneak back to school and uh, yeah it, it's, it's been crazy it's been crazy I, I've been through a lot and at the same time being labeled like the quiet one the corny one the one that just you stay away from him I, like my yearbook is completely empty the only person that signed it was two teachers of mine so <laughs> like it really wasn't until my senior year where i pursued my passion for drums to the fullest where i met one of my best friends alex raspberry that's his name alexander raspberry we found him out uh he was playing bass one time he also played drums and he's actually pushed me to learn a lot like i learned a lot from him yeah, he's pushed me to like really work on my drums but uh yeah i basically when me and my brothers met him we started our own jazz band and we got so good we started playing everywhere in new jersey like we played every high school in new jersey we was just doing that and it got to the point where we even replaced our drum line which i didn't get accepted into because i couldn't read music and like they didn't even want to stay time with me that's a whole nother story but yeah um i, I said that i say this like even going through what i went through in, in high school like my gift literally made a way and it, it, it like it got to the point we we was on the local tv the gigs that we were doing and like people just walking up to us this was before youtube too um before youtube was really crazy and they were like yo y'all do Y'all the band, we saw y'all on TV. I'm like, I'm like, yeah, that was all during senior high school. So wow, it, it, it was it was crazy. It was it was crazy. And to, I'm, just, I'm saying all of that to like look at me now, like that's that's what's crazy. Like, sh huge shout out to Jesus, man. He he has a way to like literally he show out. <laughs> Like, it's so crazy, like, out of all that stuff I went through in high school, and then look at, like, that's why I'm, like, it's so ironic to see that Michael B. Jordan post in that video. It's, like, for real. Like, you want to grind when they think it's corny. 
like and shout out to <laughs> I got that I got that quote from Swag uh, Gaming Channel. I'm sure some of you guys know, but yeah, man, like grind when they say it's corny, when they hating on you and stuff like that. Keep doing what you're doing, and like it's it's gonna pay off. It's gonna pay off. Like whoo, and and that's when and when they hate again, it's just a reminder that it's paying off. Like at this point. Any type of hate or negativity and stuff like that. It's just it just reminds me that like something something's doing great. And that's why they coming over here to do what they're doing. And it, it goes so deep as to like I've gotten hate and shade from people in this community. And it's it, it's it's so crazy. Like that's why you gotta be careful who you look up to. I always heard that. Uh, but until I actually witnessed it, yeah, you definitely got to be careful. Um, now I've forgiven these people, but I've definitely, I definitely haven't forgot. And uh, yeah, it's, it's people I looked up to that I never met. I meet in person, and it's, it, it's, they're different. Yeah, that's all I can say. They're, they're different. And um, yeah, you gotta watch out for that stuff. And I've learned to like literally it, it, it happens. It's sad that it happens. It's really sad. Uh, Drumio, uh, Jared, CEO from Drumio, had a, a, an interview on Instagram and he talked about it. And it, it, it's, it. I don't understand it. I don't understand where the hate comes from. But then again, like it, I, it's social media. It's it's people's egos. Like I, I've seen, <laughs> I've seen drama in the wave community on YouTube. They're arguing about their hair. So I mean, it's it's sad at the end of the day. But like I said, for everybody that's watching this video and you're dealing with depression and anxiety, you're not alone. I've been through it. Once again, I've been like even now, even now, like if there are times where just randomly I get tested randomly by people I looked up to and it, it's it's sad but um it's always it's a test at the end of the day and it's gonna end up becoming a testimony like I said before like no matter all of the shade and the stuff that I've been through and to see actually the accomplishments that are happening I remember back when I had like a thousand subscribers I'm sitting here watching Drumeo watching all the lessons and the live streams and now I'm in the conversation of being able to go there and record with them. It, I've been reposted on their page. I, I'm, I'm sponsored by them. We do different sponsorships and stuff now. And like Jared followed me, Drumio followed me. Like it's the turnaround. It, it's the, it's so, the way God finesses everything. It's just, it's it's amazing. <laughs> it's so it's, it's perfect. It, it's perfect. Like. The way he's writing this story is just so amazing. And guys, just keep going. All right. Keep trusting in God. Keep on believing. Keep following your dreams. And use me as an example. This has been like my journey. Like it's really has. It's been ups and downs. It's been people, families. Um, it's been churches. Whoo. It's been a lot of those. Like <laughs> it's been a lot of churches that have literally flipped a script on me and caught me completely off guard. And uh, yeah, we we'll, we can dive into that if you guys have got any questions about that. I'll gladly answer them on the Q and A. But this is also this is strictly for anybody that's fighting depression and anxiety, and you're in high school and you see those popular kids and they just blowing up right now, getting all the attention and all of that stuff. That does not last that's all i wanted to talk about like be encouraged you guys use me as an example man i didn't man i i grinded and i always had this in the back of my mind what i did not believe was the backlash that i was going to receive from people i looked up to and that's not just drummers that i've reacted to or drummers that i looked up to it, it's all it's people it's family it's 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 people that i thought were friends it, all of it i'm not the only one that's dealing with this stuff i'm just letting you know use me as an example on a way to block all of that out and follow god watch what happens just watch what happens 
he's going to finesse a storyline for you that's you you're not even gonna be able to believe it. Like it's this is just the beginning. That's what's so crazy. This is all the beginning. My goodness, man. Guys, that's it for today's video. I hope you guys got something from this. I hope you guys are encouraged and stay encouraged. And uh yeah, I'm gonna do more videos like this. Make sure to hit that like button. Make sure to subscribe if you are new. You already know what to do. <laughs> and I'm out of here.